All right. Gold, silver. Gold, silver. Let's do it. Uh, let's load this at Game Boy Duel. There we go. I like how we I like how we waited to do this second now that there's no sunlight left. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's a thing that's going on. Hey, what let night? Me try, let me try turning on that light. See if that helps. Okay, you can go turn on lights. One second. Hold this. My cord is right next to the mic cord, and I don't want to move it and risk shutting that shit off. All right. It's uh, this one. Oh, that's a little loud. There we go. Turn it off successfully. What? I turned off the fan successfully. Did you? I don't know. I hit it. Hey, it worked! I did it! Where the oh. hell's the sound? Oh, it's still going. Never mind. You can pull it again. There are like three speed settings. Oh, are there? Is there any change? What? To the, to the lighting. Is it noticeably different? A little. Oh, damn it. Set on your controller. Oh, that's the remote. Never mind. <laughs> I'll play this with a fucking. Uh... Ah, that's better. Now, now it's it's ambience. Yeah. It's ambience. Okay, let's see if we still have our uh, controllers set up for this. Okay. I yeah, think... I do. Okay, we're good. I got a mystery gift. I think you unlocked Mystery Gift. Maybe? No, why don't I have it? Press A to link Infrared Device. Remember Infrared? Oh my gosh. Infrared made a comeback. It's on 3DS now. Oh, is it? Why? I don't... I, okay, no, actually, I think they it reintroduced it for the DS. And 3DS, I guess. You can... In, like, black and white, too, I think you could use it as a means of trading or something. Welcome, Grim Alchemist. All right, so, uh, what am I doing? Uh, you just got your Pokemon egg? Is that what I- No, you- No, no you got the Red Gyarados, and you just got the EXP share is what happened. Uh, did I capture the Red Gyarados, or did it just die? I think you just killed it. Okay. I remember there was some shenanigans about you trying to capture it, and something went horribly wrong. Okay. I vaguely remember that. It's been a long time since we did, uh, Gold and Silver. Who do I have the- um... I just got my Teddy Ursa. Uh, it's a bear. You the one with the item? Okay, yeah, okay, so Romani has... Oh, right, you got a cow. Hmm. EXP share. And he's gone! Gotta get my cheat sheet! <laughs> Haven't used that in a while. Haven't needed to. Man, it's been a while since we played this. Not as long as uh, Mario RPG, but... Ugh. It is... it's night time. It is night time. I wonder what time it is. It's Poison Cure Berry! Yay. Poison Cure. Alright, so next up is on your, my... So is your party complete? I... um... Did you get Surf? I believe I did, yeah. You did, okay. I want... I can't remember, can you use it yet? Uh, you can't surf. Not either. here! I think you have the badge you need for it, so if you... I guess... Okay, you want to go back north again. Shit, really? Alright. Yeah. You're kind of far from where you want to be, but it's okay, you can walk. You can uh, go back to Slowpoke Well, that town, and that's where you get the item you need to evolve Slowpoke into Slowking. Alright. But, that's through... Uh, that's through, like, caves and shit, so it'd be better to just keep going until you get fly. Alright. It gives you some time to hang out with Slowpoke. Yeah. What's a little... Does he change into a slow bro again? Hi. 37. Okay. So here's what I'll do then. So there's no chance of you reaching it before you get fly. 
No, no, no. Here's here's what I'll do then. You're gonna level your slowpoke. Oh, you got the EXP share. Yeah. She, oh, you ha gave it to her. Okay. So I'll give it to him. <coughs> and then switch over to somebody else to, uh... I want my slow king. This is not on the virtual console, by the way. We've started this run through before, obviously. Yeah, it's not on the virtual console. It's on something far less, uh... Acceptable. I like how Nintendo finally released their game on the virtual console, and as if we're giving them the middle finger, we're celebrating by playing the ROM. It's okay, we own the game! Yeah, I actually did buy the virtual console version. I am going to play through that and uh, build my Pokemon collection. Oh, are you not a trainer? I ran out of Pokeballs while I was catching Pokemon. I should have bought some more up north. I know, I'm just, uh, uh, I'm gonna level up a bit. Here, with the level 2 Pokemon? Well, I mean... <coughs> I guess you're kind of low level, so... Uh, no, it'll work. Stomp! Just a cow stepping on an owl. <laughs> Animal cruelty, what? <laughs> the owl's just looking up, just like... Ooh, and then the cow just... Boosh. Big boot. Who do I still need? I need a few people. Some of my final team isn't until Kanto. <laughs> Spoilers! Spoilers. Oh yeah, remember, uh, sometimes this game has a habit of randomly deciding, hey, you know what, here's some cataracts. Oh, right, yeah. Did that, did, did that just happen? No, I'm just, I just remembered. Yeah. So we I'm have, take uh, a surprise. We have this. had that. Alright, how much, uh, do you, more do you need, uh, Palpy? So it's, uh, it's getting to be autumn, winter season again. I like how we record after dark during the day, and now all of our other streams are actually after dark. Yeah. We should call it, we should rename it from after dark to red light district. Yeah. Jack's red light. Or... Oh, sorry. 279? Okay, fuck this, I'm going up. Yeah, there are much better places you could grind. The minima, the grimer just decided to make itself smaller. Oh, right, you can, uh, you can just press A on trees to cut them now. Yeah. That's nice. This is very handy. Dark cave. This is where I need to go? No. Thank you. Left. Ain't no one got time for dark cave. I walked too far today looking for Pokemon. Oh, right, you have head. Oh, whoops. Yeah, wild Pokemon. Oh, what will I encounter? <coughs> it's a Spearow. Oh, hey! And it's asleep! Oh, you woke it up, you asshole. What no, you I didn't don't. Wake up? I didn't, though! You just, because it's asleep! You just knocked the thing out of the tree sleeping. It's just like, it uh, fell out. I, just... <sighs> I think that just happens at night. You just shake out sleeping Pokemon. Do I have one? You probably shake out sleeping Hoot Hoots in the day. <laughs> Get it? Cause they're nocturnal. Like us? I yeah. Well, you mostly. Me. me I can't afford to be anymore. I'm a bus driver. I wake up when I need to. I sleep when I need to. Almost. Still sleep. Fighting some poison. Yeah, just big pile of muck. There we go. I caught a Spearow! Just wakes up and suddenly it's a fucking... Uh, captured. Oh fuck, what did I do last night? Oh, you're my Pokemon now. Fuck, we didn't do it, did we? Battle! No! <laughs> well, um... I mean, we did I mean, battle. I didn't, I didn't hurt you. Do you have regrets? Nickname. Uh... It's a good bird nickname. Sleepy. <laughs> what if you just never go to a Pokemon Center? It's just asleep for the rest of its existence. It wakes up at the very last moment. It's like, hey guys, what I miss? You can do that in Red Blue because Pokemon don't get healed when you put them in the PC. Oh. You just have a Pokemon that was asleep its entire existence. <laughs> you cryogenically freeze it. Yeah. Wakes up and then fucking Earth is just destroyed. 
like, years later after the Pokemon, like, storage system explodes and everything is freed. Well, that's gonna be the Pokemon Apocalypse. If Y2K happens, <laughs> they just get all get freed from the various trainer boxes. And then suddenly an an onslaught of just angry as fuck Pokemon. Just... Yes. You think they were, like, po <laughs> like, they have something, like, uh, where the nurse nurses are like, okay, you can keep it in there, but if you don't... Come and check it, check up on it after every so often. We're gonna send it to the wild. Maybe you, there there'd be so many like Ratatas and Bidoofs who are just furious at being caught and stored away, never to be seen again. Man, I caught you for the Pokedex entry, and that is all. <laughs> the Ratata re Revolution. Ratata Revolution. Oh, we're being attacked by a bunch of Ratata. So oh, what are they gonna do? Sir, there are five million of them. It's God okay. help us. It's okay, we got like ten Pikachus. They can each like take a third. Yeah. Of, of like... Of ten, it. All ten thirds. Ten thirds. <laughs> oh, my mistake, there are actually like three times as many. <coughs> they can all take... You got ten Pikachus taking a third, ten... Twenty Raichus taking another third. And, and one the Mewtwo. And then the final third is just Ash with a stick. Yeah. He could probably take out a Rattata or two. <laughs> then again, knowing him, he'd probably have a type disadvantage. Alright, where am I going? Uh, keep going to the left. Okay. Go left. Where is the Pokesin? Here we go. Didn't you just heal? No? Uh, no. no. Oh. Well, I guess I, I need to restock on my weapons. Wait, what's he? I'm sorry, who are you? Which one are you again? Oh, the Sans? Santino! Oh, Santino! Oh, yeah, the. Because he got a not mask. No, Santino, because he's Cobra. Oh. Cobra! Is that a luchador? Ah, uh, he's a straight up pro wrestler. Oh. He's called Santino Morello because he's supposed to be Italian. I think oh. he's actually Russian in real life. Yeah? Like, funny, funny how that works out. He's like Boris Alexiv. Alexi. Very Italian name. Boris. Is Boris... Are there any Italian people called Boris the... Oh, sure. oh, yeah, that's right. This guy's my cut, dude. This is oh, ow. Ow. I got white. Oh, you did? Well, that sucks. Oh, yeah, I got Archimedes, my, uh... The one owl. of my final party members. Then Mama Elliot. Who always is, like, great. Romani's gonna be a final party member, and Palpatine as Slowking's gonna be a final party member. Which means that two more are gonna be HM slaves until I figure out what they're going to... You caught a ghastly, but I don't think... It's in your PC now, isn't it? Oh, yeah. you fucker. One HP, time to self-destruct! You'll never take me alive, copper! Oh, hey. You make any new Pokeballs for me? Wrong place. Oh. She'll, she'll give you an Onyx for a Bell Sprout, though. Do I have the EXP share? I don't have a Bell Sprout. NBC traded Pokemon to just not follow. Yeah, whatever. Did I beat the gym here already? Oh, it has the EXP share. You did, yes. Okay. Keep going left. It's been a while. I'm this is one of the early towns in the game. Keep going left, and you'll reach where you cut down the Sudowoodoo. At right. the T path. Oh yeah, I gotta take down the pseudo Udo. No, you did that already. Okay. It's been a while. I'm trying I to. Know. That's why I'm trying to guide you. Just keep going left, 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 left. Up. Up now. Yes. You're going to. Oh wait, trainer tips. Use dig to return to the entrance. Except not in Sun Moon. You can't do that anymore. They removed all field moves. Because you got ride Pokemon. Except you can't dig with them, so there's no... You gotta use escape ropes now. Oh, man. They finally have a purpose they again. They finally have a purpose. Nerf dig. Is it still, like, a pretty decent attack move, though? Yeah. It's, like, 80 power. Well, it also allows... It throws people off their guard because you just faint. You just dodge their one move and... Oh, here we go! Finally, a challenge worthy of my skill! And finally, an owl worth stomping on. Oh! See, look, you survived! <coughs> Here we go. Oh, 
Ah, still not enough, though. It's the best you're gonna get at your level. Well, also, the EXP share is splitting it in half, so... Yeah. Speaking of which... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna lead with my underleveled bear. I'm gonna let him EXP share it for a while. Alright. Oh, it's daytime in my my world. Yeah, we're, uh, sun moon hitting it. Oh, right, we did. I forgot about that. Yeah, it's now, uh... Yeah. Yeah. Sun! Where's the next town? Is it up here? This is the town you were at, and the next town you're gonna go to is left. Okay, so I can actually just kinda stay here and you already, get some levels. Yeah, you already beat the gym here, and you already, uh... You already got Surf. Did you go up into the burn tower? Yeah, oh... Fight your uh, rival? I, I don't believe I did. I should save first. Yeah. Something tells Spoilers. me. Spoilers. Something tough. Rival fights are tough. He opens with uh, the ghost, Ghastly or Haunter. To okay. So plan for that. Uh, somehow I will. Magnemite, now a steel type. Confirmed. Science has proven this. <laughs> uh, what can I use again? Nothing. I got nothing against him. Use your shadow ball. All right, fighting some owls for fun and profit. It's, it's even better in Earthbound when it's just your main character just fighting a bunch of like wild animals. Yeah. Like dogs and snakes. With a baseball bat. Yeah, and it's just like the townspeople like go, "What the fuck you doing, kid? What's wrong with you? I need to level up. I need to get stronger." They like. Some, there are a lot of like really crazy enemies in that game, and I that's why I like showing off RPGs because yeah. some of the RPGs have like some really unique enemies, and Earthbound's got some really crazy ones. <laughs> Everything wants to kill you in Earthbound. You mean like a uh, a cow who can sweep your entire team? Enemies like that. <laughs> Whitney, man. I was thinking about it. I actually felt kind of good when she started, just started crying. It's like, where? Swallow it, bitch. I actually, I watched the the Nintendo UK release trailer for Gold and Silver on the Virtual Console. Uh-huh. And part of it, there's like a couple seconds where they're showing off like, meet old foes. And it shows like a Team Rocket grunt and it shows your rival and it shows Whitney. <laughs> As the last They knew! Show. And they showed her, and then they showed the mill tank using rollout. They knew exactly what the <laughs> fuck they were doing. Oh no! The true, like, threat of gold and silver. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone! What's your team? You've got the cow, you've got Snorlax, yeah. you've got the owl. The next gym's a fighting type. So that's gonna fuck up your normal types. Uh, and what's your- Is fighting type uh, weak to ghost? Is normal against ghost. Fighting type can't hit ghost. Better grab. Yes! Sabrina tactic. I gotta catch a ghost to defeat the psychic gym leader. Even though, you know, it's. Even though the ghost doesn't really want to cooperate. And the ghost is actually weak to psychic, technically. But, you know, this is a, this is a good idea. This will work. I love how the, the anime just straight up lies to you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's normal type. Yeah. Sorry, I, I, I. You is, thought it was like psychic or something? I'm still stuck on sun moon physics. Oh yeah, where you can tell what your moves are gonna do. Yeah. That's, oh, that's one thing. Wait, I what? What just happened? Palpatine? He, he gained like twice as much EXP as the other two. Is he traded? Did we no! Tra trade him from somewhere? Was he in the Wait, battle? Wait, what the fuck just? He, Was, okay, if so... If he's in the battle and he has the EXP share, then he gets more EXP. No, but he wasn't in the battle, though. Hmm. I don't know why, then. Maybe I have it's... a theory. I'm gonna try something out. Okay. <laughs> God, I am getting fucked by every grunt I encounter. I'm, I'm giddy as fuck right now. What do you think okay. you encountered? A glitch? Explain your theory. A I, I think I encountered an oversight. Yeah, it's like, very possible. Like, maybe it, like, EXP share doesn't, like, it doesn't check once and, like, divide it. It just adds in half every time another trainer comes out. Every time another Pokemon, like, comes out. 
I think it might be something like that. I remember it acting weird in the first couple iterations. Oh, God. The weird is good for me. All right. Let's try this out. Come at me, owl! Sorry. No, I wasn't... No, no, no I wasn't referring to you. What is that? No, 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 nothing. You know. All right. Owl! It's still just the sad cow okay. cry. So now that I'm gonna switch over to Mama <laughs> Elliot. Did you mean it got twice as much as the other Pokemon? Yes. Yeah, it got. Then, yes, that is how it works. It splits it in half, and half goes to the EXP share, half goes to the other Pokemon. All right. So, so it's not like I can just cheat the system. No, it's still the same amount of overall EXP. Durant. Oh well. Headbutt. Twenty six, twenty six, fifty three. So yeah, you're right. It, it uh, that's not how it worked. Would be cool if it did though. Yeah, I think it was like that in the first Pokemon Gen. Just in some way is is that because uh, remember you couldn't hold items, so it was an item in the bag that you turn on or off. Yeah. <coughs> like, remember... Uh, and, uh, I... One, one thing I really like is games where that just allow you to get something for nothing. Yeah. Like, yeah, Oblivion had a really big oversight uh, involving uh, item duplication and, like, scrolls. Yeah. Like, if you were to, like, hit a scroll with, like, multiple, like, stuff, and you just hit A, and you it dropped an item, it would drop, like, that many of that item. So yeah. if like, you had three scrolls, and you had three watermelons, it would create three watermelons. Yeah. They never fixed that in, like, the well, version I played. The great gift we have in Gen 2 is Pokemon cloning, which you saw how incredibly easy it is, and apparently is still usable on the Virtual Console. Oh, hey, that's cool! So, yeah, you can just clone a bunch of good Pokemon and just send as many as you want to Pokemon Bank. <laughs> so, I, I don't think there's a way to... I do know glitches to get Celebi in this Gen, but... I don't think you can send a glitch Celebi to Pokemon Bank. Fair enough. I would be su I wouldn't be surprised if they just said no Celebis at all can be transferred because there's no there's no legit way to get it on Virtual Console. Just right find now. a way to get it. Just Nintendo should be able to figure that shit out. They should just have events for them, yes, but no, they don't. Nintendo's so. in a kind of a very weird middle ground where it kind of cares about its fans, but not that much. Yeah. It's very aloof to towards its fans. Yeah. Meanwhile, you have... Uh, it's, arti it's fucking... It's Pokemon artificial scarcity. Yeah. It's like it's like the shit they did with uh, the NES Classic. And they're still doing, yes. With the NES... With the SNES Classic. And I think the Switch, to some extent. And Amiibos. Don't forget Amiibos. Oh, yeah. Artificial scarce... Like... Why, though?! We gotta make sure that the secret Pokemon are exclusive. Like, if everyone has them, they're not special anymore. Uh, but, at a certain point, I don't think... It, uh, you know, we can't let people get, like, material for this game from 20 years ago. That would be silly. Lost forever! The Forbidden Game. It's and like you, the Forbidden Room except with video games. There never was an event in North America for Celebi at all. There's no way to get a legit North American Celebi. Yeah. It was only in Crystal version, and it was only in Japan. It's Forbidden for Hiroshima. Yeah? No, your fault. I thought Grave of the Fireflies was revenge for that. No, you know what? You can take revenge multiple times. Yeah, all the revenge. Revenge, revenge! So Stantlers are really good for EXP. Owls, they're not good uh, for... For like eating, but the deer are apparently just like the venison. Good old delicious. Yeah, Stantler are Stantler are fully. They do not evolve, so uh, which explains the high exp. Okay, awesome. So I just come out here and I just hunt Stant <laughs> Stantlers just all the time. Yep, just go hunt some deer. <laughs> Effective. All right, I'm gonna get them up to like either 15 or 16, and then I'm gonna stop. What's the average level for the area I'm going to? Oh, I don't know. Okay. You're probably okay. You got a bunch of trainers on the next route you can fight, too. Well, there's also the fact I want to oh, get... the rival. When's rollout? Oh, I don't know. Okay, that might be a T. No, I'm sure it learns it naturally. 
It has to! You already... Keep in mind that you're supposed to fight the rival before the gym leader and the kimono girls, which you already beat. Oh, yeah. So you might be okay to take them on now. <laughs> yeah, keep crying, Whitney. You deserve... You deserve it! <laughs> you deserve it! Just Photoshop that wrestling dude, big... The guy who's getting beat up has Whitney's face plastered yeah. on him. And then as like, he gets taken into the ambulance when he tilted the ambulance over. And the ambulance just says Pokemon Center on yes. it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Braun's face would just be ashes. Or the trainer for this game. Yeah. <laughs> God. Oh. I'm not finished with you! I told you that uh, my dad actually found at like a garage sale some Pokemon comics. Oh, really? And one of the ones is actually the first, like... The whole, oops, the whole red story of Pokemon Adventures, the manga. Oh, nice! So that was a cool find. I've been meaning to read that for a long time. Cool. You can do it legally. Yeah. Man, apparently the Pokemon Adventures manga is, like, really gory. A lot more so than the show, anyway. Yeah. The Wait, show, it's just the like show. they get hit, they just fate, and they're like, ah, oh, rest well. Even among Saturday morning cartoon anime, Pokemon is pretty much the kiddiest. Oh, it is. Like, when we get to the end... I'm, at some point, maybe not anytime soon, but I do want to watch Digimon with you. And I do too, I've never watched some, Digimon. There are some dramatic situations in Digimon. Yeah, like, uh... Way more than the... Po they, they go places that Pokemon doesn't. Well, it's like, you, how do you differentiate yourself from the... From the others. Like, one kid almost gets his, his sister killed in some instant and his mother slaps him on camera. Oh! Gotta be killed, big brother. I'm sorry. Yeah, Slap. Kid show. Gotta be dark, edgy. There's an there's an uh, there's a Pokemon wrong hack that is coming to light with a bunch of like YouTubers, I think, called Pokemon Edge Rising. Ah, oh, yeah, I heard about that. So, yeah, have you seen it? I haven't seen it. I, I heard that was a thing. I'm like, oh, an edgy parody of Pokemon. I've seen a little bit of it. It's pretty edgy. How edgy are we talking about? Attack on Titan. <laughs> Oh, there's giant Pokemon? Yes! Are these all original Pokemon, or...? Some. Okay. There's a Psychic Rattata. Psychic Rattata variant? <laughs> yeah. Uh, ah, oh, that's cool. Like, if you were to do Pokemon, I'd love to see you just take the Aloha variants and just turn it up to 11. Alola! Say it right! Sorry, it's Alola! Not Aloha. It's not Hawaii, it's I'm totally sorry. It's original, unique, and new. Okay, so Pokemon Gen 1... Gen 1 and 2 were both, like, various regions or eras of Japan, basically. Yeah. I don't... Like, Johto seems a little more traditional Japan, like Kyoto, versus yeah. more modern Kanto. Yeah. And, and then Hoenn... Hoenn's kind of its own thing. Hoenn... Uh, how, what's the... What's the... I don't think Hoenn and... I think they started basing... What the fuck? A Vulpix?! Sure, Vulpix. Did, we ca did I catch one yet? I don't think so. You wanna catch a Vulpix? I'll catch a Vulpix. Catch a Firefox? Where's the Chrome Pokemon? <laughs> oh, Steelix? Yeah. Alright. I think that that might be good, but just in case... I don't think they started basing Pokemon regions off of real locations until Black and White. Where they're just like, hey, let's go to America! Yeah, let's make it like New York and America and shit. So... Ah! Get set on fire! Oh, there's a Porygon. Oh, okay, birds aren't weak to, uh... No. For some reason, you thought that flying was weak to fire. Well, it's because I picked a Charizard. Charizard always steamrolled through birds, so... Charizard oh. steamrolled through everything. Yeah, because he's fucking Charizard! Dragon, motherfucker! Okay. So, yeah, G Gen 5, black and white, was America, big cities and shit. Gen 6 was... I would say overall Europe, but I think they mentioned specifically it's based on, like, France... Which makes sense, because the evil team in Gen 6 is, like, metro as fuck. <laughs> and then Gen 7 is obviously Hawaii, so we've got mainland America, France, and Hawaii. Oh, do you know where Gen 8 better be? Where? <laughs> You'll be great. Russia, mother Russia. You want to be really edgy? Set Gen 8 in, like, the Middle East. Yeah? Just sand region? Then, then you have, like, a, like a terrorist, a Pokemon terrorist group. Oh, God. That would be what, edgy. What would, what would their team name be? Is this a female? Alright. Uh... Team, team blast. Sure. They only use. I the feel only moves so they bad. use are self-destructive oh, explosions. I'm a horrible person sometimes. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, no, don't do that. 
Don't do the, don't make a ROM hack. Vulpix for Gleamy. Very. You know you what? You should name it Gleam. Oh, but I I could have. You can it's name a it fox, you right? Want. Yeah. Tomomo. Yeah. It's great because it's gonna turn into a nine-tailed fox. Yeah. It's perfect. You feel the energy all around you. Dude, this firestone goes so well with my soul. <laughs> Let's eat! Feast on Stantler uh, tonight! Dude, I'm a vegetarian. I don't know if you knew that. I eat thin fried tofu. She's a fox, right? Fox are carnivores. Yeah. You know what? Monster Girl, like, stuff aside, I would love to see just, like, characters that that are, like, you know, they can switch between, uh, like, animal forms and, like, semi-human forms if they oh, want like to. Oh, like Fruits Basket. Well, at will, not, like, whatever the fuck's going on with Fruits Basket. Or Ranma. Or Ranma. Where it involves, well, like, cold water. Cold water, hot water. Oh, great, this dude just got, like, six coughings. I bet they all know self-destruct. Volatile chemicals. I'm gonna headbutt it to death. What the fuck is coughing? Uh, like I've always, sick. I've always imagined it being like the texture of a rock, which made me wonder why it wasn't rock poison type. I imagine, or else it's like some kind of like rubberish balloon thing. Wait, I'm asleep. Oh shit! Yeah, you're asleep. I missed that. I don't know, I think most sources compare it to a rock. I just, maybe it's just an oversight why it wasn't rock poison. I, I, I always thought, like, uh, like it was just some creature. Oh, that's very descriptive. I, I, I know, but I just, like... Like... Oh, fuck's sake! Like flesh and fur? Yeah. You think they're huggable? You think they're fur they're fuzzy? I... Maybe it's, like, felt. Maybe, maybe it's vinyl. Maybe yeah. it just made out of vinyl. Polyesterine. Oh god. Blow up coughing. <laughs> it's got a lot of holes. You put your dick in this. It'll never you'll never see it again, but it'll be the best fuck of your Flushing life. Flushing! Yeah. Orgy Pokemon! It'll melt inside and it'll feel so good. God. I can just imagine Luca, get away from that thing! I can imagine just like a deviant art coughing where it's just got all these open pores and gross holes all over its body. Oh yeah. <sighs> It. Oh, it didn't affect. Well, uh, I'm gonna bite you. Yeah. One seventy-five. Are you sure it's like it's just? I feel like I'm I'm gaining more than, or maybe it's just the Stantler is that. Uh, I don't know. You can try it without the XP, sure. If you only have one Pokemon in the fight, it should split it half and half, right? I think so, yeah. Unless it's just, like, cloning it. Like, the way experience works, I imagine that just be just witnessing the battle is enough to just fucking... Oh, the Magikarp method. You're yeah. going up to the top left is where you're... Oh, if you want to face your rival. Otherwise, you can go keep grinding grass. Right, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save and I'm gonna face my rival. My fears... <coughs> mm. Hey, rival! No, that's just a little girl. This used to be a much taller tower, but it burned down in a fire. Was it set by somebody? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. He's right inside. Okay. I get. Yeah, you just saved. <laughs> oh, it's you! You wanted to get stronger. So you came here for the legendary Pokemon. What? Well, legendary to... Pokemon? There's supposed to be a Pokemon here. Oh, thanks for the info, rival. Well, that's not going to happen. Okay, Pokemon Edge version, this is your character. <laughs> Who's your rival? Not literally, but this is basically how your character talks and acts. Oh my god. Oh, I'm about... gonna get it. Who's the rival in uh, Pokemon Edgelord? Uh... There's, a, like, a blue knockoff, like Gary Oak. 
and there's just like a dude bro who's totally chill and not edgy in the slightest. Oh, that's so great! That perfect rival! Yeah. I'm gonna be the world's greatest trainer, so a legendary Pokemon would be perfect for me. Yeah. Maria. I'm getting tired of a whip like you always showing up. Or fighting. Good rival theme. Vegeta wants to- oh right, I forgot Yeah, I named it Vegeta. Yours is Vegeta and mine's Shadow. Oh. You didn't plan for the ghost, I... did you? Well, it's Dark type, right? Dark type, uh... No, it's it... not. It's ghost Stop. poison. Oh. Is no, Nothing you have will hit him. Well, I better get the fuck out- oh no, it's too late. Okay, I got poison. I got... Uh, poison's not very effective. Archimedes. Psychic is super effective if he knows any psychic moves. Does I Mama Elliot know anything that's not normal? Uh, Shadow Ball. That's super effective. Alright, then... There we go, we got a plan. Mama Elliot! Uh, technically Missy Elliot, but... Yeah. It looked at me meanly! Oh, my feelings are hurt. Oh, well. Anyway. WHY THOUGH?! I want to curse you again. I need to be really thorough. Palpatine gate 270, somehow. Yeah, I'll change. Magnemite. Uh... I just made a mistake, though. Yeah? Unless my guy can go first, in which case it's not too bad. You gonna hypnosis him? Go to sleep. Oh, why not? Hypnosis has a pretty low accuracy rate. Thankfully, Supersonics is even lower. <laughs> Ooh. I think Supersonic only has like a 55% chance of working. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, here you go. Oh, I, I can always foresight hypnosis. Oh, wait. That's not going to work, is it? No. Also not very effective. Not a lot can hurt the steel type. Yeah. Can't send out Palpatine because he'll die, so... Uh... Yeah, Mama Elliot, let's go. The best thing you can do is hit it as hard as you can. Oh no! Oh, that's okay. A Dolkin! Oh, steel, it's not gonna work. His special defense fell, but you don't have any special attacks. See, Shadow Ball lowers the special defense, but it's a physical move, so it makes no difference. Well, then you can, you can use a Shadow Ball, and then follow it up with, uh... A special move? Yeah, like Psychic. Yeah. If only, well if only Mama Elliot was Psychic. Yeah. You know, then good... she'd be Madam Elliot. Madam Elliot. <coughs> we just Fuck keep changing... poke in a dress. We just keep changing what the M stands for over the course of the playthrough. Master Elliot. MC Elliot. What was it? You what know, did it say? can a Snorlax Mega Evolve? If it could, it could give me Mega Elliot. There is a Mega Snor uh, Mega S oh, Snorlax. Yeah. No, I don't think there's a Mega Snorlax. There should be. Well, it would, it would just be it, but it's like in a Hawaiian shirt, just chilling on a beanbag chair. It's got a soda in one hand, it's popcorn in the other. No, that's a Alolan Snorlax. That's Alolan everything. There is a Mega Slowbro. It's just like just the shell, and it's oh, it's sticking yeah, out. it's top. Yeah. Oh, just a bat? Okay. Also, I just caught way the uh -oh! fuck off. I just got caught way the fuck off guard by my rival. Your rival? Who is Shadow? Shadow. Wants to battle. Hey, it worked! Die already. Oh, almost. I'll have to, uh... Oh, good. I have super effective. Maybe I can take him. Maybe I'm good. Romani, I'll allow you to deliver the final blow. Thank you, master! Move. Yeah, you're not a threat. Take this. Buy this Minotaurus brand milk. <laughs> hey, leveled up. Uh, what do I get? Uh, level 2, yeah, sure. Palpatine crew to level 15! Awesome. Try to learn water oh, gun! Got, but he has surf already, so water gun is useless. No! Yes. I don't need to learn projectile vomit, thanks! It uses its tail as a squirt gun. Yeah. Croconaw. What the fuck is a cro- Oh, Water. it's the- 
I really wish that they kept the, uh, the, yeah, the, the starter, ri rival starters we chose for the whole game. Yeah, it, it makes sense for the rival just fucking abandon it, though. Yeah. Like, fuck it's, you. I lost once with him, why would I keep training it? Archimedes. It's water type. Hello, Ripizzeroni. Good to have you join us. Uh, what what type is water type? Thank so yeah, you. Sorry. so uh, you don't He's have like a pro wrestler. You don't have any electric. You don't have any grass. You have a very normal centric team. Yeah. Hey, work work for Whitney. Hopefully, I think when you get the TM for it, you can teach like Archimedes psychic or something. So if you I use foresight on something, does it does it mean every attack hits or just the next one? Just the next one. Okay, I've planned it. But it will make uh, normal moves hit ghost types. But you don't have any... You really need a normal attack on your owl. Did, you didn't duplicate with a headbutt TM, did you? Oh, you can buy another one in Goldenrod. Oh, cool. Just have a bird just be able to fly at things. Yeah. I'm getting this game for Virtual Console tomorrow, but I won't try away since, start right away since I'm going to try to get Shiny Chikorita. Good luck with that! I don't know how long exactly Shiny hunting takes in uh, Gold and Silver. I know that it's based off of, like... It's based off IVs, which are actual, like, a gameplay stat. And they later changed it so it was a totally different variable. This is just sad. You just pecking and a sleeping... the trainer going, No! Wake up! Please! What's with you and abusing sleeping animals this stream? Hey, man. I can't fight back. Oh, speaking of which, uh, animals, I mean, not me abusing it. Yeah? I was coming home from work last night... And you and I, I'm like getting the, the fence, the garage door up to get my bike in and get my sodas on top of my, or my teas on top of my car so I can drink them later. And I yeah. look up and I see one of the cat neighborhood cats on the roof. Yeah. Just chilling up there. And I'm like, on our uh, roof? Yeah, our roof. Like, How'd up here. up there? I, you know, it, I, it pulled a gourmet guy. You know, cats are known to just get up on high places randomly. I'm yeah. not, I wasn't too surprised. I'm like, hey, well, I guess you could stay up there, cat. So, uh, how yeah. long before you find a cat inside your car just eating out all the shit in there? <laughs> just old food and shavings? Hey, you know what? I, they're welcome to it. DVs have to be 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10 to be a shiny. I, okay, I remember that. DVs? Uh, d d IVs? Individual you values? You mean IVs? Or, no, those are, uh, those are, uh... Those are, values. Those are Pokemon's base stats, or the IVs. And females can't be shinies, it says... I, I Not now, Anthony Hiker! Got a minute? My Geodude's looking awesome. I wish I could show you. I managed to beat a tough Rattata! See you later! Oh, this is cool spoopy music. Yeah, but first... They weren't IVs until Gen 3. What, were they just called a different name? District values. Determinative values. Dick values. <coughs> yeah, dick values. Good old DVs. I want to see your length and your girth. Also, your stamina. Luca boy. Yeah. That's why they... <laughs> You notice we talk about dicks and such a lot more often since we started getting views on the After Dark videos? <laughs> they were also different in value. You're not thinking of uh, effort values, EVs, right? Because I know those were totally different in Gen 1, where you just got, like, the Pokemon's base stat as <laughs> EVs. Not and then everything was, like, multiplied by 10. Having a conversation that only, like, the most obtuse Pokemon nerds are gonna get. So, yeah. I but mean, yeah, they didn't have... Okay, in later generations, like, X and Y and uh, Sun Moon, they introduced an item called the Shiny Charm, which actually increases your chances of finding a wild shiny Pokemon. So they made it, like, something you could unlock in the game, is easier shinies. And I break it with my, with my headbutting it. And then I pull out my gun! No, you need Rock Smash. Do you have Rock Smash? Uh, <coughs> just take my word for it. I'm a competitive okay. bad battler. Okay, I don't claim to be. Hey, you are. I lost to this asshole. Hey. I got nothing to say. Hey, Digipal. Uh, it, 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 show us some of your videos of your competitive battling. I'd like some tips. Like to uh, be able to 
beat this guy. You know more what often. competitive battling is? It's taking all this math and just grinding Pokemon. That's that's what it is. Oh, so that'd be something I could do when I watch pro wrestling. Yeah, just uh, grind for perfect IV Pokemon. <laughs> Perhaps. Be a breeder. Breeder. I'll do that eventually. I want to get like good IV Pokemon in Sun Moon. I'm literally Gleam. Oh, hello, Gleam. Sorry, I didn't mean to disrespect you, but oh no! Oh, hey! I'm just happy. Why does your coughing look so much happier than my coughings? Oh, hey! Dude, why aren't coughings a member of Team Skull? My coughings are, uh... My coughings are on nicotine, yours are on THC. <laughs> Dude. It's coughing, but it has a pot leaf in place of a skull. That's the, uh... What's gonna be- Yeah, the locals like to inhale these ones, Fumes. Gen 8, the Colorado region. <laughs> it's just full mountainous forest region. I'm sure that there is a, uh, obviously there, there's like a skiing town. I'm sure there is a holy pot-themed Pokemon ROM hack out there. <laughs> gotta be. There's gotta be- uh, Okay, the most pot-like Pokemon, Oddish. You just spread its leaves out slightly and it's a yeah. pot Pokemon. It knows- <coughs> It no spore that you can take those spores and smoke them. Oh, I guess Gleam has a YouTube channel that he uploaded some battle videos to. Awesome. We'll be sure to pimp those out somehow. I guess I gotta go underground. Uh, uh you- ah! You actually need Rock Smash- uh, Do you need Rock Smash to progress? You might. Doesn't matter, found an HP up. Are you sure none of your Pokemon know Rock Smash? You didn't teach it to any of them? No, I- it would have told me, so I got I know headbutt. Because you have the TM for it. I know headbutt. I know surf. Cut. You have the TM for Rock Smash. I how about I didn't replace it? You can you can buy more rock smashes. So yeah, you just gotta oh, yeah, teach I do. it to I someone. Just... Okay, who wants it? It's a very it's a weak fighting type move. It's like 20 power. So oh, it's not, really? not powerful. I can replace it later. Yeah, you can. Who do you think needs the better move variety? Uh, Romani just has Growl. She can do without that. Yeah. Growl is pretty worthless. Who ever heard of a cow growling? Cows don't growl. They moo. Defense curl. Stupid cow. Defense curl you might want to keep only because it uh, it has a, a hidden effect where it doubles rollout's power. So if you defense curl and then roll out, roll out is stronger. Uh, it's because you're, you're getting yourself set up. Yeah. I think it was like that from this this gen. They didn't make that, they didn't introduce that feature later, did they, Gleam? The defense curl rollout combo? Look at the, look at its stubby little arms. Can't believe a Tauros taps that. Yeah. <laughs> Weird. You got the Tauros, which looks like a, like a, the most like an animal. Then you got a fucking mill tank, and it looks huggable. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, that that's a thing in this gen is the rollout tactic combo thing. Palpatrine team grew to level 16. Oh, you f you idiot! <laughs> you self destructed while I was digging. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what we call a bunker buster. War what is that in level the center? Six underground. What if I reached the the appropriate level and he just evolved into Tyranitar while still underground? Then he just rises out of the earth like a fucking kaiju. <laughs> the earth starts to tremble and there's like a, a you see a glass of water with a drop appearing in it. <laughs> a glass of water with a Yeah, there's a thing in Godzilla, is that like the scene where he shows a glass of water with a drop shaking to show the ground vibrating. Oh yeah, that's right. I think it was also in Jurassic Park. Same oh yeah, thing. just... <sighs> oh, I, apparently if the opponent uses Minimize, that double stomps power. Oh, that's good. I'll have I didn't to know that. So, um... <coughs> trying to think. Uh, a Starship Trooper had a really good variant on that. They were in space. Uh, the water. Oh, right, the cup yeah. of water. So there are these guys in a spaceship just flying around and then... They look at the uh, like a glass of like water or coffee or something, and they notice that it's that the that it's just kind of moving to like one side, and they're like, 
this gravity well. And they look and they're like, oh fuck, a meteor! Yeah. And I'm like, <laughs> it's just like, they have to dodge it. Apparently in the remakes of Ruby and Sapphire, there's like an extra part of the game where you save the world from a meteor. Oh, by flying out into fucking space and blowing it up with your mega Pokemon? <laughs> no, I don't want to get poisoned though. Oh, but that's another thing. Pokemon trainers can breathe in space. I'm telling you, they're fucking superheroes. We're gonna go to space now. Oh, and Yay! underwater. You can use dive and just hang out underwater. And at the bottom of an ocean trench, just thousands of feet per inch of pressure on you. Not a problem. Totally okay. Bins, fuck that. Enter a volcano, breathe the sulfur air. It's great. Yeah. Pokemon plan Pokemon trainers are immortal. They gave you sh oh, they don't give you a space suit. Shut up, Gleam. Don't don't ruin my theory. <laughs> they gave you a space Gleam just just playing foil to Zelrog. But you don't have a suit underwater, so you can't prove that they don't breathe underwater. No, they get they get diving. They get like an air tank. Oh, like, oh no. here we go! Rats! Oh. I might want that. Rat? Nah. Fucking more rat infestations all over Johto. Yeah, I mean, they breed quickly. Yeah. We don't get a, uh... You're either good survivors, or you outbreed the enemy. We don't get a rabbit Pokemon until Gen 4, and of course it's needlessly sexy. Uh oh! My soul is on fire! Let me show you how hot it burns! Oh gosh. Fuck this puzzle, by the way. You're gonna have a lot of fun when you get here. Alright. I'll, I'll take your word for it. Ned! Ned? Is that his name? Yeah, his name was Ned. Ned's declassified Johto survival guy. <laughs> Name that because he rhymes with that. What? Oh, he missed the tackle somehow. Jolton, Jolteon is technically part bunny, I believe. Bull How? Shit. According to what? Lit, list your sources, Gleam. I don't buy that shit. Yeah, he just somehow spontaneously developed <coughs> rabbit DNA. About to use Growlithe. Will I change Pokemon? Yes. All right, Palpy, go spray him down. We're gonna, we're gonna hose a dog for only the second time today. Oh, 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 oh! Is that a dog? Don't curse yourself. Oh, look, hey, look at that! <laughs> it's like two parts of an animation. <laughs> Yours is like it's just about to bounce. That one's barking. That one's smiling. Yeah. I swear I heard that somewhere and it kind of makes sense. Nah, you're just making shit up, Lee. <laughs> I'm a curse you! Maybe it's one of those things that comes from like a, uh, like a Mexican dubs bo DVD box art or something. <laughs> what was that shit in the Toph versus Gara fight? It was like- Oh, they looked at the fucking, uh, like- like during episodes, they had like a little like "Did you know?" commentaries, and then they looked at one of those and are like, "Yeah, we could use this." I thought it was like the back of a DVD in a, like a European DVD or something. No, it was literally like just direct up director's commentary. It was like, "Did you know, Toph?" Wait, what? <laughs> so if you fight as uh, as Slowpoke, it just splits the experience up with itself. Oh yeah, did it, <laughs> did it list it twice? Yeah, it went up one section, then it went up another section. Yeah, it'll do that. Will I change Pokemon? No, I'm feeling lucky. I mean, it's funny, but at least it's functional, unlike Gen 1. Yeah. Better than, like... They actually, Pokemon Stadium is like a Gen 1.5, because they changed mechanically a bunch of moves. Like the, uh, the bind tactic in Gen 1, where you just keep someone from moving. Uh huh. By just keeping them bound, they, they changed that in Pokemon Stadium. How's that work? It just they just are able to move. Uh, yeah, it's the same as it does from Gen 2 onwards. It's just progressive damage. Uh, well, that makes sense. 
It does, but it kind of fucks over you if you, you know, built a team like that in Gen 1. Well, that's karma. Yeah? <laughs> that's just karma taking effect. So, uh, what's my karma on my, uh, Gen 4 Smeargle? Uh... That was, uh, Spore Lock on Sheer Cold. Well, not... I guess you didn't get to experience that. That was some other dude that was like a roommate at Job Corps. He oh, challenged yeah. me to like a, a Pokemon fight, and I brought out my Smeargle, who was just like insta kill. Oh god, I forget. How, how pissed did he get? He, he just said, Oh dude, I didn't know you had shit like that! Fuck off! <laughs> so pretty pissed. Alright, let's go. Spore has 100% accuracy, it'll just immediately put opponent to sleep. Lock on ensures the next move hits, and then Sheer Cold is a one hit KO that works on any type. <laughs> Damn. That's, you know, that's pretty... <laughs> it's a little devious. Not competitive yeah. by any means, but... Well, because it's like a, a three-step one, and the, you can fuck the guy up by just, uh... By just switching out Pokemon. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think that crit. No, it didn't. Also, I guess cows are immune to poison. Uh, no. You just got lucky. Oh, uh, the methane. Alright. Then Palpatine gets some, too. Alright, where are my Pokemon at? They're actually pretty decently leveled. Thing is that Satsuki... I don't know if Satsuki will ever be competitive, though. Yeah. This is good, like, old Japan music. <laughs> like, I, I could hear this in the background of, like, a... Uh, like a Ninja Scroll Sword for Truth kind of movie. Ninja Scroll Sword for... <laughs> <laughs> that genre, you know. Yeah, the genre. Oh, uh, Japan exploitation. Yeah, sure. It's when the Japan exploits itself. Animated cheesy samurai film. Uh. Oh, I don't have any uh, any healing items. All right, all right, Elliot, Mama, you're uh, you're up. Oh, whoops. That's not what I wanted. Good luck! Here we go! Into the Down pit! The hatch! Oh, you need- that's just for an item and you need strength. Fuck's sake! Nope, that's content for later! Uh... <coughs> so what's that up there? Is that a Lugia? No, it can't. Is that a Lug? Oh, there's a trainer battle, fuck. So the, this one, the guy's just like really happy. That one... He's like, uh, hello. He's kind of sneaky happy. He's like, he's like, he's giving you a side one. Yeah, shake, oh, yeah, shake what your mama gave you. Does he die? No, he does. He survived. Yeah, I'm good. Barely. Magmar, fuck that. Magmar, bye. Is it, it's making a duck face. Why is it making a duck face? <laughs> it's like making smoochy. Yeah, you need a different hole. Yep. You need a different hole. Good one. Wrong hole! <laughs> clot, clot quality line from Dead Leaves. Dead Leaves. Really fun. I'd argue that Dead Leaves is well worth, like, seeking out, because it's pretty short. And... Yeah. It's like 45 minutes, an hour long? I think yeah. 45 minutes ish. And you! You shit too much! We're gonna kill you for it. It's like, what if Ricky O was animated? Yeah. And you got dead leaves. Animated specifically by Gynax. Yep. It's a very Gynax production. Is that it? Or is there one on the other side? You gotta go up and around like the spiral. Oh, I see it. I would like to. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go heal. Oh, fuck. What am I being attacked by? Rats! Oh, okay. This is this I can deal with. You know what? Just head... Just head... Just headbutt it. Smack it in the skull. Shabba the headbutt. Where he actually just cracks his head open on a guy's other head. Other head? His dick? No, the... You need to go heal? Not his own head. He headbutts himself. In the dick? No. 
You said okay. other head. No, the other guy. The, the head of the other guy. Oh. And you can hear it, and it's just like disgusting sounding. The good old Yusuke technique. Like, gave himself a hematoma that way. Tragic. Our, your Pokemon are fully healed. Bye bye! So Pokemon are like ethereal energy beings, right? Are they though? I mean they can get sucked into a like little Pokeball by turning into like red energy stuff. But that's or something. just that's just science. They that can works. get stored but humans can't get going Pokeballs. They're incompatible. They can get stored in PCs as data. They're uh Human well that's because nobody tried hard enough. Yeah, is that just is that the problem? Nobody's like, they need to believe in it. You gotta do what? You gotta believe. So this is what game's team, so last game's Team Rocket, this game's Team Rocket again. And the game after that is uh, Aqua Magma. Yes. And after that is, uh... And you know, I think they give them more of, like, themes in, uh... I guess an Emerald and an Alpha Ruby Omega Sapphire, is that, okay, Team Magma look like cultists, Team Aqua look like pirates. <laughs> oh, the hoodies? Yeah. And everything? Just like the general theme and style. Gen 4 is Team Pla Team Plasma? Is that it? Uh, I, I think, think it... I think it's Team... No. So named because they love the... Because they love giving blood. It's not... Team Galactic, that's it. Team Galactic, and they're all, like, uh, space, sci-fi, Jetsons, future-themed. Uh, Gen 5 is Team Plasma, and they're the fucking Crusaders. Okay, in Pokemon Black and White, they're Crusaders, like European Knights and shit. Yeah. And, and then in Gen... In, in Black Pokemon and Black too. and White 2, they turn into, like, pirates. <laughs> yeah, it turns out the... Turns out Crusading wasn't for us, so we just became pirates. And they're still Gen called Team Plasma. Yes. Gen 6 is the Europe one. That's Team Flare. <laughs> and they're all in, like, suits and sunglasses. 127. They're the vaguely Metro ones. Nice. And then, as you obviously saw, Alola is Team Skull. And Team Skull are the coolest. The thug punk dudes. Oh, you fucker. I was gonna quick attack. You took my move! Good evening, I'm Anthony. Friend just told me this. A lot of dune sparse in Dark Cave. You ought to go look! What's the point of getting a dune sparse? Ah, uh, don't laugh at how silly it looks. Uh, so, uh. It's not a useful Pokemon, though. No. Imagine not. Oh. I. Did you do a thing you shouldn't have done? What'd I do? I guess that's it. I guess we won't know. Was I not supposed to do that no, yet? No, you were. Okay. So, as you can obviously tell from that quality sprite work of those obviously, you know, quadrupedal sprites, those were the three legendary dogs. <laughs> and they're now running all over Johto. Oh, no. I remember you have to find them and, like, track down their movements. Yes, you have to uh, You have to capture all three if you want a chance to get Ho-Ho -Oh in gold and silver. But it's well, okay, you don't need to go through any of that shit to get Lugia. Lugia, best fo Pokemon. Focus, energy, fuck that. Because Lugia's Ash is dead. Yeah? I think. It's very confusing. Lugia just talks That's in like a great-grandfatherly voice, and Ash and the gang don't question it in that movie. I thought Mr. Mime was Ash's dad. Mime! If anybody would be Ash's dad, it'd be a fucking, uh... Giovanni. It'd be, uh, Lucario. Yeah? Because apparently Ash has aura abilities. Does he? I, apparently so! We didn't see it in the Sun Moon demo, but, uh, there's actually, like, that Greninja that we had can, like, transform into a Luchador state. Oh, it can? Yes. <laughs> and it's not a Mega Evolution, but it's something that was in the anime. Like, for no, no explained reason, Ash's Greninja 
can just take this unique transformation. It can become a luchador. Yeah. Because Japan loves pro wrestling. And uh, it gained, it's like a totally different form. Keep in mind the Attitude Era never happened in Japan, so so it did, so there wasn't I'm really... not saying anything about like it being a luchador. It's just, yeah. it's a totally unique original thing. It's not a mega evolution. We have no it's idea what like, the fuck it does. What does it do? I don't know. You can, you can do Hurricane Ranas now. He can uh, wager his mask against other people's titles. So yeah, you get Ash's Greninja from the anime, and it can make that weird transformation for some reason. And it does nothing. So you freed the beasts. You freed the beasts. Now you can uh, go left if you want to continue. Go left. Go left. Why not right? Well, how far right do you want to go? <laughs> you already went to. Uh, the, you already went to the right. That was where like the red Gyarados and shit was. Oh yeah, that's right. Literally. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. More rats. Shit. It's fast for being such a big fella. Yeah? You're a cow. <laughs> hey. Correction, Romani's a cow. Yeah? You thought your cow would be faster? Well, it was fair. It's just... It's just... The thing called Radicate being able to do a quick attack. Hey, guy! It took me, like, until... Very recently, like a couple weeks ago, to realize that Raticate was a pun on Eradicate. <laughs> Raticate! Eradicate! Guess I got a little carried away. Oh, this does no counter, does it? I don't think. No, that's not Wab. That's Wooper. You're thinking of Wabafet. Okay. They do look similar with like little stub tails and everything. Hey, guess what? Are we sure that Wooper isn't just like. A ditto that decided to settle on one thing. Maybe they're like genetically related. It's like a whole bunch of uh, dittos decided to start breeding with polywags, and then the, this the, the, the gene pool just got fucked up. Yeah. Lost the ability to change its form, but it gained the ability to love. It makes sense too because the evolved form, the what, what's it, mud something, that Wooper like, and Quagsire. Flagstar is just this blobby, amorphous tadpole thing. With a derpy ditto face. <laughs> Should we play Yokai Watch once just to see what it's like? Should we? I don't know. I mean. Do you want to buy the 3DS game? You're welcome to. <laughs> Yokai Watch! Fun we're hunting for ghosts! Yeah. It's the new... It's the next competitor that's gonna fail to beat out Pokemon. <laughs> we had Yu-Gi-Oh, we had Digimon, now we have Yokai Watch. Oh, you forgot about, uh... The... The Devil one. What? Okay, so... Altus, uh... You know, the makers of, uh... Persona and, uh, SMT. Or Megaten. Yeah? Uh, they, uh... They made a Pokemon-like game. Okay. And, uh... <laughs> I wouldn't say this is on the same level as Digimon and, uh, like, Yokai Watch, given that I've, n I've never heard of it, and I'm sure I've, many other people have. I've heard, heard of it. it! Oh, do I have a Meowth? Meow. Yeah. I'm getting that Meowth. You might have it. No, you don't have it. It would tell you if you had a Meowth. Oh, because of the... Cause yeah. Of the, okay. I'm getting that Meowth. You had a Meowth in your red-blue party, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Alright, uh... Oh, I got an amulet coin. A oh of, shit! A, fr a weird number. <gasps> Still alive. Okay, okay, good. <laughs> a weird number of stuff on both our screens is like syncing up this stream. Yeah. Okay. Archimedes, lull him into a nice call. I'm sure you can catch it now. I I have to nuke the site from orbit. It's the only way to be sure. Don't want to peck it. That'd be a bad idea. All right. You're tired. You're asleep. That's another normal type, though. Yeah. Probably don't want it in your party. No, but I'll have it anyway because, hey, it's a cat. Okay. Just get caught. One, 
to get the Pokeball. loves anything that shines, it especially adores coins that it picks up and secretly hoards. This version of, of Meowth is just really cute. Meowth? That's right! <laughs> so. Amazingly the most successful opponent against Lena Inverse. <laughs> what was that, that one's name? Jealous. Oh, this one's a female, though. Yeah, you so already think... had, you had Corrin last time. Uh... Big? No, you had a big last time, too. Yeah. What's another cat? Man. What's the thing from Yokai Watch? Okay, you know what? Shout, shout out to my cat. Uh, <laughs> shut up! She wasn't like that all the time. No, just, just for a quarter of the year. And she's no longer like that. They spaded her recently, yeah. so. Well, not recently, but a while Since ago. Since you were living with her. Yeah. Nabby, for those of you who are unaware, is my cat. Yes. Uh, or was my cat. Now his parents' cat. Yeah. Can't uh, really bring her over here because uh, my Mark. parents love her too much, and we're not allowed to have cats here. No, uh, we've tried. The landlord is not uh, not down with that. Otherwise, I totally would have a cat right now. He is not. Uh, the landlord is not DTY. Down to yif. Fly high to the sky, my beloved bird Pokemon. Oh uh -huh. shit! Not prepared for birds. Do you have any rock? You don't have like rock slide or anything, do you? I have. Rock Smash. That's not good. Uh, you, you'll just have to hit him hard. I always hit him. Stomp on it. Stomp on the bird! You trained for this with the owls! <laughs> Owl stomping. <coughs> it's Weasel stomping day. Put your Viking helmet on. Spread that mayonnaise on the lawn. To, to attract the weasels, I presume. I don't know why Weird Owl suddenly sounds like Stephen Magnet. Is that just the name of every? Steven that's just gonna be the name of every Metro character we see now, isn't it? Hey, they named him. Yeah. Well, kind of. A YouTube error named him. <laughs> and then the guys were just like, you know what? Makes sense. We'll go with it. I wish there were more companies that just like rolled with in jokes that the fan base started doing like that. See, the Super seems to be doing that. Yeah, some to some extent. Nintendo kind of sorta does it a little bit. Can stand to do it a little bit more. Of, I think. I think Luigi dabs in Super Mario Odyssey. Not Mar. No. But why in, though? In the Rabbids game, I think it is. I'm a dab now. It's Rabbids. Oh hey, Yang is evolving. Oh look at that cute little. Th oh no, he's not cute anymore. Oh god, go back to being cute. Hey Boo Boo. This is a bear. Hello. Like, I'm a bear! I've got bear powers! It's okay, Coda, he's reformed. Can I have bear powers? No, you fool! Only bears can have bear powers! What is this? Is that a reference to something? An old, a really old Newgrounds flash called oh. Bear Hello. Okay. It was very weird. I remember Newgrounds. I think it's, uh, why would a bear say, say such a horrible thing? I heard someone talk about Newgrounds recently. I didn't, they didn't yeah. say a lot about it, but, uh, apparently there's, like, some discussion about advertising on Newgrounds and the state of it right now. Oh. Because that's how shitty YouTube has gotten. Oh. YouTube's gotten so shitty that Newgrounds is gonna up the advertising game? I guess. I don't, I don't know how, what, what people are making advertising on Newgrounds. I imagine a lot of advertisers aren't very keen on putting stuff there. <coughs> Which, you know, the whole thing is that, uh, they don't want to- a lot of YouTube channels right now are getting just mass demonetized. Yeah. On the grounds that basically, their content isn't so baby-friendly that, like, a five-year-old can watch it. And, well... <laughs> See, here's the thing. YouTube's not a substitute for, like, parental guidance. No, it's not. And also, five-year-olds don't actually, you know, spend money on things, so. And the logical thing to do would be to do like TV does and have different, like, age brackets and demographics to advertise to. No, fuck that. That's too hard. <laughs> yeah. 
It's hard. I'm it's really right. hard. Thinking about it makes my brain want to go poopy. So, nope, just no money to anyone who is not uh, PewDiePie. I don't think he's gonna get any uh, money for long either. No. He was caught saying the N word on like a stream. Those are the kinds of YouTubers that kids watch, though. You are Markiplier and, and PewDiePie and them wacky, wacky family kind of. Well, mostly, you know. No, we're like it's like those guys who are like really cool, like not cool but just really popular, and then we're like the uh, cool kids in the back, in like the back of schools, just smoking cigarettes and going, "Man, I wish we were pop." I would. We don't need yeah. to be popular like that. We did actually start. Uh, we started monetizing on YouTube. Yeah, recently. we'll get a whole ten bucks by the time the month's out. Yeah. So far, we've made sixteen whole cents. <laughs> <laughs> did, did I trigger your cough? <laughs> that reminds me of uh, during a during a, a GDQ they were playing. Uh, Commando, Bionic Commando Rearm 2. There's a Rearm 2? I think That's so. what someone gifted me recently, is Bionic Commando Rearmed. I think it's okay, but Rearm 2 looked, uh, not like the highest quality thing, but still looked pretty fun. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and they were like, hey, uh, we should have a, there, there was a glitch called Hype Mode, where it involved an elevator, and it would have, uh, the main character, what was his name? Oh, uh, I don't remember. Metal arm, dude. Uh, yeah. Just yelling all the time. He just goes... Oh, no. It just kept going forever. Yes, until, like, certain things happen. And they're like, hey, we should have, a, we should have like, a donation incentive. And we, should we keep hype mode on or not? Yeah. And then they, and then by the time it ended, it was like, okay, uh, we have 10,000 some odd dollars for hype mode, and we have a pity for silence. <laughs> yeah, just... <laughs> it was like, oh no. Aren't you a cute trainer? Oh boy, thank you. I'm like 10 years old, lady. I'm 10. AOC's lower here because death is higher co a consequence. Oh wow! Oh, She's beauty Valerie. Sent out. Oh, the really light one. Weighs just a pound. Grass flying. Did you know the, uh, there's a Pokemon in Sun Moon that, uh, starts as the lightest Pokemon in existence and evolves into the heaviest Pokemon in existence? Oh my god, what's it? What, what is it? Uh, I, I won't spoil it. It's kind of spoilery. Alright. Got to use Skip Bloom. Sun, Ultra yeah, sure. Sun and Ultra Moon come out in November, but, because... I'm sure it's a situation where the story is he he heavily relevant to Sun and Moon, so... Ah. Uh, we probably shouldn't stream those immediately. Perhaps. And also, I don't know if I can afford getting them immediately. No. I, I imagine not. Crit! Oh, I'm sure... Oh! We, we sure, sure we would get a big audience for that, though. Maybe yeah. I should do solo streams of it. And you're not allowed to watch. Okay. I'll, uh, I won't watch. I need some stuff to stream solo. Because half the stuff that I've been kind of interested in, you said that you want to be around for, so... Yeah, it find some stuff... <coughs> i got Crash I can do, I've got, uh... I want to play through the Shantae series soonish. That looks like it'd be fun to just watch that app, that, that outside. Just, yeah. Just you watch you play it and just yell at my screen like, YOU FUCKED UP! And Rayman we're talking about, if that'd be something that we did together or not. Rayman, I, I can probably leave it, because that's a fucking hard game. Yeah. And I don't want to yell at you for playing it. Yeah. Oh, it's meditating! It, it, its cheeks look so pinchable in this version. Yeah. Like, you just want to I'm... Oh, no! Please don't. Oh, I'm still a leer. Oh! Oh! It's not very effective. Oops! What did you use? Fighting? I used Rock Smash. Yeah. Fighting is not good against Psychic. Ought to bully it some more. Do you think we made Lee mad with the Jolteon's not a bunny comment? He left after that. Oh, did he? I'm sorry. He's not talking anymore. I'm just killing all the traitors. Or... I think this is the last one for this stretch of route. Alright. Unless, did you fight the sailor already? I 
don't... I don't know. Possibly. Eh, let's keep going. Uh, yeah, I, at the very least I want to get to the next Poké Center and just see what other Pokémon I have. Like in the PC? Yeah. Because all... Because the other two are, a. Uh, HM slaves right now. After the next town is the uh, Johto water route. Ah, so you're gonna have to go through the ocean. Which means no new Pokemon, just tentacle. <laughs> Always fun. Uh, yeah, hey, uh, what's a good Pokemon to use? Tentacool! Tentacruel isn't bad, he's just. He's so common, why would you want to use one? It's like using Rat versus Jellyfish, who like would win? It's like using a Zubat. God, Rat. I guess it's okay in this gen because you get Crobat and Crobat's kind of cool. Yeah. Even if some, like, design critiquers don't think so. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, you remember <laughs> that when I told him, oh, yeah, some guy thought that uh, Crobat wasn't, wasn't the highest quality uh, item. Yeah. Because... <laughs> he liked Zubat's design the best of the three, right? <laughs> no, he said he liked Golbat's design. Did he? With the big, like, gaping mouth. He said he, he said he could deal without the eyes. Yeah. He liked the big, gaping, gaping mouth. The Pokemon never allowed to close its mouth. All that. <laughs> hey, close your mouth. You get flies in there. <laughs> uh, what am I doing? Oh, switch. Just playing some Pokemon. You can go right to the next town from here. Grinding grass. Left, you mean? Left, yeah. I, it, Mama Elliot is, uh, Missy Elliot's almost. Holy shit! It's a magnet. Okay. Well, you, did you want a magnet? Sure, fuck it. I haven't, I don't use, ever use these. It'd be nice. You know, electric steel type? Yeah. Those are two not common types. Okay, still very alive. Flying weak to electric? Yes. Can't hypnotize him then. You can rock smash. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, I mean, you could try to hypnotize him. You'd I don't know if it does Would have to. tackle some... just get it low enough without killing him? Probably. Fuck it, I'm going. I'm just going for it. Stop absorbing me! God, wake up, bear! It's not winter! Yeah! Fuck! Sonic Boom! It missed. Times two. Wake up, bear! That's a lazy bear. Ow. Oh. I give a less fox than the average bear. Uh, what you say, uh, boo boo? Why Yang? Uh, I had the four horsemen and then just yin and yang. Uh, to fill out the last two slots. I really should come up with like a, uh, a six-name scheme. Alright, uh... I think my red-blue team, not in our playthrough, but in the, in, like, my usual team, was, uh, like, named after a bunch of Nordic gods or something. Ah. Uh, like, man. Skold. Here, I'll use a great ball. It's very great. It's great! Hey, it worked! I sent the snake out and used a great ball. Oh, I got pecked. Look how derpy looking Murkrow is in this game, by the way. <laughs> Just showing you its ass. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Go get him, War. Oh, don't nightshade me! What's a good name for a magnet? It's gonna evolve into three magnets. Uh, actually, it's PH. No, Steve. No, that'd be a good name. You should uh, do it. <laughs> I got it.
The swarm! Okay. Well, is that a reference to? It's just like, there's m multiple. Oh, what? What? Jack, good evening. It's me, Brant. Got a minute? Sure. How are my Pokemon doing? Pretty well now I got EXP share. My Lickitung's really energetic. You have a Lickitung? I guess so. Is it like I managed you know? to beat a tough Vinodat. Are you doing like peanut butter things with your Lickitung? What's going on? Peanut butter things. Some of you're not telling me Brent's beast stuff. You know how people describe Adel's butt stuff? You got beast stuff. Yeah. I like I had uh, boy stuff, girl stuff. I saw a comment. Dead someone stuff. I won't say where I saw the comment. So I saw a comment someone made earlier, like today or yesterday, and they said this person said that. Uh, I like how if you see like a picture of an animal that shows the naughty bits, it's not porn. But if it's a drawn picture of an animal showing naughty bits, it is porn. <laughs> Thank you, internet. Like I'm sure, depending on like the pose and what the camera is focusing on, it would still arguably be considered porn. If you just had like a picture of a dog's dick on your phone, and that's all that's in the picture. Hey, look at this! Why would you have a picture of a dog's dick on your phone? Exactly! Just show it's up, people! Like, hey! If you found a picture of a dog's vagina on my phone, you'd assume I was fapping to it, right? <laughs> either yeah, that or- be right. Either <laughs> that or there was a sexting that went horribly, horribly wrong. That would be the only logical assumption to make. Just a girl called Dirty Bitch, like, when you see some dudes, and then you just- That? Yeah. God. It, it's becoming like a thing that people are no longer tolerating, right? Like just reality. Un unwarranted dick pics. Unlike as were they tolerant of it before? Ah, uh, there was like mainly joke. People were joking about it, like, oh, somebody sent you a dick pic, and like people were just like doing it because, hey, why not? Yeah. Maybe the girl will be interested. She'll see my nice swollen hard dick and go, yeah, I want that inside me. I don't get. I don't get it. Like. You were like, hey, I want to send this girl a dick pic. I'm like, why? Can't you just, like, ask her out like any normal person? This is me saying this! Yeah. <laughs> you think Alice would be very confused if Luca sent her a dick pic? No, Alice, Alice would know exactly what he wanted. Yeah. She's looking like, okay, be over in five minutes. By the way, when did we get phones? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, you didn't fight her yet. Are you good at training? If you are, could you show me how? Uh, you, you want me to train you? Train. Put this collar on. There's a, uh, I think it's in Sun Moon. There's like, a, there's a trainer who's wearing like a Pokemon outfit, like a furry outfit, like a Pikachu costume or something. Yeah. And she asked jokingly, do you want me to come along with you like as a Pokemon? Oh. And I'm like, yes, please! Sure, why not? But no, she's just joking. Yeah. You can't have a you can't have a lolly Pokemon. Or she's no, she's not lolly. She was just like a, another trainer. She just she just loves cosplay. Yeah. Lariat! Oh, and you're dead. No, it wasn't a, it wasn't someone dressed as a Pokemon. It was a martial arts girl who was saying, like, yeah, I'm totally like a fighting Pokemon. Bring me along. Oh, that's actually kinda of doing Ah! Confusion! That's good. That's a good move to have. Uh Growl. Who needs growl? Yeah. Cool. I got a type spread with confusion with uh, psychic and and yeah. uh, water. So your slowpoke has an offensive arsenal now. Yeah. Will I change Pokemon? No. Or a happy. Psyduck are just water, not like. Yes. Yeah, despite type. having psychic in the name, they are not psychic type. And despite being able to use psychic moves, they are not psychic type. <laughs> that was rip. I hey, am a psychic. I I see. So you can battle that way. Oh, well, what? Just, just one shot in your sorry ass? Yeah. <laughs> I know something good. Mumu's farms milk. Famous for its flavor. What really? 
want me to get wanna give me your phone number? Oh yeah. Sure. So she's just a trainer who phones you for battles, is I know. That, Most of them are. Uh that guy in that hiker you got the number for tells you about swarms. So you got that info. Oh, not just my swarm? It's that specific guy will tell you about the Dunspar Swarm, and there's another guy who I think you got the number for who tells you about Quillfish Swarm, ah. which are like pufferfish. Cool. There are a couple of swarms in this game. Let me see what your Pokemon are capable of. Okay, I got my pokers back. Psychic Norman. <laughs> oh, hey, look, he's happy. He's showing his belly. Yay! I'm happy! Why'd you do that to me? You sound like the I can see the future guy. <laughs> I, I, I can imagine a slowpoke just going, I can see the future! No, it's slower than that. I can see the future! Can you tell me my future? Would you like to know your future? It, yes, I said that. Yes, I can! Now, now, don't be impatient. <laughs> this is, let me read the palm of your paw. You're going to die. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Is it gonna be soon? No. Well, when will it be? Eventually. <laughs> slowpoke for slowpoke. Let's do it. Have nothing that's gonna be not not very effective. You don't have like a, a tackle or a physical move, do you? I have a tackle. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the only thing that's gonna do normal damage, except now he just cursed himself. <coughs> Where am I at? What am I doing? Oh right, I got uh I beat Team Rocket, yay! This is not gonna go well. I'm gonna switch out. <laughs> yeah. You oh you got your Magnemite's not in your party, is it? No. I don't know who to re probably Santino. Oh, I went to I went through the ice tunnel apparently. I don't remember what the fuck I've done. It's a lot. Ah, oh, Archimedes, you gotta hypnotize him. How many badges do I have? I think I have all the y'all the last one. Okay. Wow, you're already like almost through the game. Through Joe. I'm just remember I'm. Ideally hoping to go for, like, full Pokedex, so I'm still going to be at it a while. Flying... Oh, fuck me! This guy is... This guy, like... Slowpoke's tanky. And he, he just... He raised his defense, so... Alright. Ah, uh, fuck. I wish... Do I have anything that can pierce defense? I don't think so. Mama Elliot's like your hardest hitter. Right, I guess I'll have to headbutt it till it dies. You'd think being asleep would lower the defense or something, but no. Oh wait, Shadow Ball works! Oh yeah, that's, no, that's a physical. Yeah, it's super effective, you're right. It's still physical, but it's super effective. <laughs> I like the Pokemon Colos, like, Pokemon Stadium, like, Slowpoke, because it gets hit! And it just kind of hit moves his head back and forth, and then just reacts like later. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh, oh. Is that in the actual Pokemon Stadium? That's yeah, animation. That's that was his animation. Smashing snake dragons. <coughs> just throwing rocks at Dratini. Oh, your Pokemon have potential, guy. You know, Pokemon have different abilities. People are like that too. Everyone has different potential. Okay. Well, oh, bye now. This is the Moo Moo Farm. Enjoy our fresh and tasty milk. Give me your milk. Our milk even goes out to Kanto. So if our own milk tank won't give us any milk, we're in trouble. Oh, is there something wrong with your milk tanks? It's sick. It's giving us blue milk. My milk tank ain't giving me milk. No more. This here farm's got famous milk. Most everyone wants a drink. It'll give me lots of milk if and I feed it lots of berries, I reckon. Ah, I'm Southern. Oh, you want... You want, uh, I feed you some berries? 
I got berries to spare. No. It takes a lot of berries. A lot of berries. Really? Yeah. How many berries are we talking? Oh, I don't know, like 10, 15? Fuck me, that's a lot of berries! That's a lot of berries. I think just all you get from this is the ability to buy milk. You don't even get it for free. Oh, man, what does milk so, do? It's Steel. just a healing item. I don't think it's worth it. You better to, you're better off just. All right, leave this farm to starve to death. You deserve it. Do you think this is why the cry sounds so sad? Is so they'd have this plot line? I don't know. Maybe of the of the sick cow. I mean, it's not like cows are uh... known for their health. Yeah. South of here is the next town. Hey, a mint berry. Mint Berry Crunch! <laughs> oh, hey, they're selling the the Hall of Halloween cereals now. Oh, yeah? The Count Chocula Boo Berry. The, I wonder what the progress is on the Fractured Butthole. What is that? The South Park game. Oh, yeah. I, I haven't heard about that lately. I think they're still working on so it. If you skip around, you can fight these trainers or skip around them. The town is just right past them. Okay. Town skip! Yeah, that would end up working out. Cool. Trainer tips. Use headbutt on trees to shake Pokemon out. The trees actually do, on an individual basis, have different random encounter rates. Oh, really? Yeah. That's just different every time you enter an area. Oh, that's cool. Hey, a Weedle! <coughs> yeah, it's not sleeping. Oh, I guess you already caught a Weedle. Yeah. I'm gonna kill it. Ah, it just flies away. We got team rocketed. So that was kind of uh that, that happened. Kind of boring. Nothing. Head with the tree. Trying to get yourself a hair across? Oh, are, how strong are they? They're pretty strong. Better be. They're a bug fighting type. Yeah. Oh, the common rider. Pokemon. You can get, uh, they're rare, but you can get both Heracross and Apom, the monkey Pokemon in trees. I think I grabbed an Apom already. <coughs> I don't think you have an Apom. Alright, we are now in Olivine City. The port closest to foreign lands. We want to go to Kanto, this is where we would go, I presume. Oh, fuck. No! 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 You bastard! Oh, I'm sorry, did I forget to tell you? I'm gonna punch you in the face! You again? There's no need to panic. I Why didn't you tell me? Speaking of weaklings, the city's gym leader isn't here, taking care of a sick Pokemon at the lighthouse. Boohoo, just let sick Pokemon go. What? A Pokemon that can't fight is worthless. Oh, okay, good. Whew. <laughs> I knew he wasn't gonna fight you, that's uh, why I didn't I didn't you're tell mean. you about it. Yeah. I give you a little scare there. Alright, so I need to go, uh... Steel-clad defense girl. Oh, so she's in the knight in training. Olivine is on the sea, and if it's on the sea, there are bound to be fish. I've fished here for 30 years. Would you like to face the sea and fish? Give me the fishing rod. Ha ha ha! Oh, it's not an old... It's a good rod. Yeah, you get... You either got the good rod... The old rod already, or you could have gotten it already. Alright. Can't wait to go fishing! Give me Pokeballs. What new fishing Pokemon are in this game? You've got Chincho, which is like a water electric. That's it off the top of my head. You got a. You got Surf the new. Mail. Uh, <laughs> I, 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 I was like armor for surfers. Hey, speaking of Gongoro. <laughs> Cody! We got the bleached cool trainers. Oh no, it's Cody Rhodes is gonna come and like. Destroy your Pokemon in the name of the Bullet Club. There's the new Horsey evolution. It can turn into a dragon type. Kingdra. Oh. Kingdra. So it's uh, Horsey, Seedra, Kingdra? Yes. Alright. Stock up on some Great Balls. Yep. Only the best Great Balls here. of Fire. And then, yeah, that's it. Uh, I'd like to sell some. You know what? Never mind. I'm good. I'll keep my shit. Alright, let's continue. Hello, laddie. 
the sea is sweet. Sing with me. Yo ho, blow the man down. <laughs> Don't call me a ho. Also, I'm ten. So there was a there was this uh, female pro wrestler called Pirate Princess Kyrie Hojo. Yeah. And uh, and I'm um, and she went signed to the WWE and they changed her name, but only the last part instead of Kyrie Hojo she's now Kyrie Sane. Okay. I so guess because ho. Does she go super sane? <laughs> Kyrie Ho Kyrie Sane is is adorable though. She's like on Twitter and she's like learning English from watching the good dinosaur. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like of all the things you can watch, it's the good dinosaur, but at the same time it's just kind of adorable. Oh, at talk to those guys. Oh, okay. Who are these guys? Who are you? Crossing the sea, then listen up! There are whirlpools on the way to sea and wood. Okay. Your Pokemon must know a special move to get over the whirlpools. Let me guess. It's whirlpool. Yes. Give me whirlpool. Your Pokemon sure look like lightweights. They don't have the power to move boulders aside. Use this and teach them strength. What? Ah, uh, hey, uh, you, you need a special move to go, go in whirlpools. This isn't a special move, but you can use it anyway. Yeah, you actually only need Whirlpool to get to Lugia. It is not required for any plot purposes. <laughs> Alright, but we know Strength now. How yes. strong is Strength again? Is like the strongest? or It's like 80 power, so it's a decent physical move. But if you have it, you can never... You get it. you get access to the move deleter in the last town in Johto. Ah. So you're gonna... I don't think... You could give it to Snorlax in place of Headbutt. It would be stronger, and I don't think Snorlax gets any better moves for a while. Alright. So I'd recommend something like that. Actually, you give it to a lot of your Pokemon. That... I don't think there are any better, like, normal-type moves, except for, like, Hyper Beam or something, so... So... Yeah, fuck it. Just give him Strength if you want him to have a good... Oh! Can your Owl use Strength? Ooh. Strong Owl! Yeah, Strong Style. <laughs> strong Style Owl! Just give it to any normal type Pokemon. That's actually a good boom for attack power. Yeah, I'll I'll do it. I'll give it to. Oops. Uh, pack. It's an HM, so it's reusable. Body slam is best normal move. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so that's basically it's strength. It's 80 power, but it also has a like a 50 percent par paralysis chance. Strength does. Uh, body slam. Oh, okay. Does. Yeah. So, yeah right. Eventually, when you get access to Body Slam, that'll be slightly better than Strength, but they're comparable. Alright. I would still use Strength for now. Fair enough. Alright. You are now- oh. The Owl cannot Strength. <laughs> Palpatine can Strength. The Cow can Strength. Oh, the Cow. 30%, apparently. Shut up, Gleam. Santino! It's 50% and there are no spacesuits! It's 30%. Yeah, it'll be good on Elliot. It'll be- Good on Romani. Do I really want to teach it? Okay. Uh, you unless said replace gonna, headbutt? Unless you're going to use it on trees, in which case, it's a better move than headbutt. Okay. So, and you can buy, more, could, you can buy more headbutt TMs if you decide you need them later. Fair enough. Also, Santino knows headbutt. Oh, yeah. You're headbutting Cobra. It's cool, I like that. Um, Tackle, though. Yeah, you're right. Tackle's a pretty good move. Tackle's a great move. What, did Snorlax no Tackle? I guess we could've gotten rid of that, huh? That's fine. We can use Tackle to uh, have the uh, body slam. Yeah, that's okay. We Let's go fishing! Finish the stream with a good old Fisher. Fisher of men. That's not too bad, though. I mean, at, at this point in the game, it's still not terrible to have Tackle, just so you have a weaker move to... We can it's like if you're with. out of, like, assault rifle ammo, you switch to your pistol. Well, if you don't want to knock something out. Like, if you're trying to catch it. So Granted, if you're trying not to knock something out, you probably shouldn't be using Mama Elliot. Yeah. Mama Elliot is a blunt instrument. A bite! What do you got? Polywag? I got... I'm gonna guess Polywag. I got... Magikarp! <laughs> yeah! Represent! You know what? Level I get 20. A oh shit! You level it up once, it's gonna be a Gyarados. You could rare candy it even. Do I have rare candy? I don't. I don't know. I can even just like throw a fuck the fucking thing on it and uh, and just. Oh it. yeah, just the EXP share. All right. Su want, suplex the fish. You want a Gyarados in your party? Yeah, I'm doing a Gyarados. I guess you already killed the red one, so. 
Did I use Gyarados last time? No. Oh, fuck me! Yeah, Magikarp are weak as shit, remember? Oh. <laughs> Guess I don't know my own strength! I got half the XP from that fish. But Gyarados learns, I think it's Bite at level 20, so you'll be missing. Bite is not... Eh, it's... How high is Gyarados' special attack? Because remember, I'm sure you know that Dark is special in this game. Not yeah. physical. Uh, fish! Let's try to catch something else. We're gonna catch something good. Well, if you're still fishing, I'll take out this one last dude. Yeah. <gasps> oh, yeah, this is... Okay, that works. Gyarados has a terrible special attack. Terrible good or terrible terrible? Because I think its main stat is attack, isn't it? It's like its worst stat. Yeah, so bite would be an awful move for Gyarados, because it's a special attack. So... For some reason, it's incredibly stupid that dark is special despite all the dark moves being like bite and, you know, physical landing attacks. How and good was Klingler? Klingler? I thought I remembered it being pretty good. I don't know, it's okay. It's a good water Pokemon, I guess. Yeah, she used it. And, uh, Ghost is physical despite it being like Shadow Ball. Weird. This is why when they switched moves to be on a tight on a case by case basis, it was a, it was good for all parties involved. Yeah. I mean that was good in general, but even even that aside, this was just a stupid setting. Not only that, but the go ghost type, which Ghost move, uh, somehow what? becomes a key. <laughs> what? So it loses balance without one of its claws. Dude. So the ghost type, which is known for having a high special stat, has physical moves. And the dark type, which has like a high physical attack, has special moves. Makes no sense. Just make the neuters the Pokemon. You know, they're, they're still trying to figure out their curve, and, you know, Pokemon's still red hot. This they logic could, thing. They can afford to make mistakes. There we go. Ah, ga 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 What was it we were watching Code Lyoko, and I randomly thought, what would this be like, but with Spongebob yeah. music? <laughs> <laughs> the Calypso music. Actually, it's not, really, it's not really Calypso. They don't use that kind of... They don't use steel drums in Spongebob. They use pirate shanty like accordions and shit. No, no, that's too obvious. No, no, Mr. Krabs. No, Mr. Krabs. Uh, and this is why Gengar's best move pool is Thunderbolt, Hypnosis, Explosion, and Filler move. Explosion? But that's a physical... I guess... I don't remember how Gengar's attack stat is. Yeah, it, it stayed that way with... Uh, it stayed that way until Gen 3. Even in Ruby and Sapphire, they hadn't added the separate move types yet. Joe's Crab Shack. Yeah. Joe. C. Joe oh, Cena! Joe Cena. Just, just do Joe. Yeah. Alright, Joe, you are now... Hey, you're catching a lot of Pokemon that you're talking about using. You still adding that Magnemite? I'm still thinking. Yeah? Alright, I'm done. You should just go through all, like, the 251 Pokemon and decide what ones you want to have for this gen. Yeah, and next gen I'll do the same. I'll just... Okay, what am I gonna grab? Explosion is special case because its properties are cutting defense in half. I did not know Explosion did that as a move. Makes sense. You're gonna... It's the Bunker Buster! Yeah. Oh, I got Yang got got. No more Yang. Get him, Pestilence. Headbutt that dragon. Yeah! Alright. So you made it to Olivine. You got a fishing rod. You caught a crab. Yep. Sounds good. I'm gonna And save. the wild dogs are running around somewhere. So that'll be fun. That'll the be good. The dogs fun. are coming. You have to you have to chase down the dire war dire wolves. <laughs> That's his name of an organization. Those are people, right? Dire wolves. Uh in in what, Game of Thrones? Yeah. Uh dire wolves are, are wolves that are just really fucking huge. Oh, okay. So in the beginning of the of of Game of Thrones, they happen upon like a dead dire wolf like mother and just a bunch of cubs. Initially Ned Stark was like, 
Yeah, these guys aren't gonna really adapt well here. We gotta kill them off. And then, uh... And then the, the kids were like, No, we want them! We don't want to kill these pups. And then... Oh, so they, like, keep them as pets? Yes. The I've, pups, heard, I've heard pups. someone mention, like, I can name all the dire wolves. So I assumed it was an organization, not like a litter of the, puppies. Oh, my... That would be a great organization name, too. <laughs> we are the dire wolves. Yeah, it'd be a good villain group. God. Okay, I'm all healed up. I'm in, I'm in the dragon gym. Next time I'm gonna take out uh, Claire... Dragon bitch. Oh, the one who who takes the loss the hardest. Aside, like Whitney takes her loss hard. She takes that loss like worse. Some of the Johto gym leaders are kind of bastards. <laughs> no, fuck you. You don't get the badge even if you beat me. Uh, uh, not doing it. No. All right, fuck so, off. So that was gold, silver. Yeah. Now on Virtual Console. Bye, bye, yes. bye. Enjoy. Not sponsored by Nintendo. Don't get that idea. No, Sp Nintendo We're sponsored doesn't give a by Coca Cola. <laughs> All right, see you later, guys. Thanks We're for watching. By Pizza Hut. Yo, Noid. <laughs>